Hello guys, this is Siddharth Saratka and welcome back to your own channel, Explore Electronics. Today we are going to learn about a new topic named Clipper. If we want to define Clipper in a single statement, then we can say that it is a device designed to prevent the output of a circuit from exceeding a predetermined voltage level without distorting the remaining part of applied waveform. I know, the definition is pretty twisted. As you can see the diagram here, it limits the voltage of circuit clips of the remaining part without distorting the waveform, which was given as an output. Here the clipping circuit consists of linear elements like resistors and non-linear elements like junction diodes or transistors. But a point to be noted here is, it does not contain energy storage element like capacitors. So we can call clipping circuits as slicers and amplitude selectors also. Now coming on to the types of clipper, it can be divided into three types and it can be named as diode clipper, zener diode and op amplifier position clipper. I know it's a pretty long name. Come let's talk about each of them in detail. Let's start with diode clipper. The main purpose of a diode clipper is to remove the positive side or the negative side of the waveform and this is how a diode clipper circuit looks like. Just have a look. Depending on the direction of diode and the half which it is clipped off, we can divide diode clipper into two types, that is positive and negative clippers. Come, let's know more about positive and negative clipper. Let's start the story with positive clipper. The main function of a positive clipper is to clip off the positive half of the input waveform. During the positive half of the input wave voltage, the terminal A is positive with respect to B and when you will move forward in the circuit will get a negative sign and this implies that the circuit is broken. During the negative half of the cycle the polarity is reversed and the input voltage terminal B is positive with respect to A and due to this when we move on to the circuit we get a negative sign and the diode act as a closed switch and an output waveform is made as shown in the figure. And further, the process repeats itself, so from this, we can conclude that positive wave is clipped off and it acts as a series switch between load and source. Coming on to the negative clippers, we can say that the direction of the diode is reversed. As in positive clipper circuit, during the positive half of the voltage, the terminal A is positive with respect to B, and the diode is forward biased, and the waveform is made as shown in the figure. When it is switched to the negative half of the cycle, the polarity is reversed and the terminal B is positive with respect to A. Therefore, the diode is reverse biased and it acts as an open switch. Thus, there is no voltage drop across the resistors. During the negative half of the cycle, so we can conclude that the circuit removes or clip of the negative part. Coming on to the other types of clipper as discussed earlier, we have zener diode clipper. And this is how a zener diode clipper circuit looks like. It is used to clip the voltage in either direction. And when we see into op amplifier position clipper, it works by clipping of small values of voltage on low level signals and is useful in many places. This is how an op amplifier position circuit looks like. We won't go in details of this circuit in this video. If you want a detailed section of this part, then let me know in the comment section. Thank you guys for watching the video and guys I want your support. Please like the video and if any suggestions or any topic you want me to take over so let me know in the comment section below. So stay tuned with Explore Electronics. Bye bye.